what is going on guys welcome back to another brand new division video In today's video we're going to be comparing two more weapons again and this is going to probably be a little bit different for you guys because i didn't think i could compare these weapons but i decided to and i actually found some things that are actually pretty similar and pretty different uh, and obviously i understand that i'm using a purple mk17 and we're going to be doing the mk17 first the svd any SVD will do fine. Uh, just the fact that I have a paratrooper one, I'm not sure how much of a difference it is from any of the other ones, but we're going to be comparing the SVD versus the MK17. If you guys enjoy this video, you guys can drop a like on it. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. We are currently 28 subscribers off of 2,900, 129 off of 3,000. Uh, but, anyways, as you guys can see, I actually have a purple SVD, or a purple MK17, because I had a high-end one, I had it locked, and it's gone now, and I don't know what the hell happened to it, so uh, I guess we're just going to have to do the purple one. It's not like the um, the fire rate or the magazine size is going to be different, the damage is just going to be a little bit different, so obviously it's going to be different for whatever your stats are and whatever maybe different variant of the gun you have, obviously, anyways, so... Not really going to make that much of a difference. So, getting right into it, obviously the magazine size is 20 for the MK17, which is slightly bigger than the SVD. But obviously, uh, the SVD has a little bit higher damage as well. So, obviously, it's not going to have like a 30 round magazine with super high damage. Uh, but it does actually say that the fire rate is lower, 100 or 15 lower than the police mk17 but in my personal opinion just from using this weapon in different game modes uh just for me personally obviously i think that the fire rate is actually personally higher on the svd i'll show you guys a little bit in the gun shooting and whatnot but for me personally i actually feel at times that you can actually shoot the svd faster than the mk17 uh, with me personally, uh, the MK17 is one of those guns that has that buffed DPS, I guess you can call it. Like, the DPS is that high, but, like, the gun's really not all that good compared to what the DPS is actually shown, if that makes any sense to you guys. Uh, but that gun is definitely a little bit harder to shoot uh, than the SVD, and the reason for that is because the recoil is a really, really, really high recoil pattern. Like, once you shoot up, it goes, like, probably, like, two or three inches like, above on your screen, so... Uh, it's a little bit harder to manage uh, compared to the SVD. Uh, the SVD has a very, very manageable recoil pattern. Definitely, I could say that. But then again, it doesn't really have a 10-round mag compared to the MK17, which has a 20. So uh, if you're using an extended mag, you're going to probably have something like in the range of like 32 bullets or 31 bullets, something like that. So um, other than that, the two weapons have a lot of similarities. They're both marks and rifles, obviously. Uh, but like I said before, the MK17 has also a lot more range. Uh, the recoil speeds or the reload speeds are pretty similar as well, so you don't have to worry about that too much. But first of all, we're gonna do the MK17 just so I can show you guys how much recoil it has. These are like just one bullet shots. To see how much the reticle goes up every single time, and this is shooting it fast as I possibly can. Obviously, it has like a fire cap. I guess you can call it so it's not going to be able to be shot like super, super, super insanely fast. Like I said, this is the recoil pattern. It's a little bit harder to manage compared to the SVD. Uh, if you guys are a person that is a like sort of slower player in last stand, you guys are the person that sort of just like sits on top of a building or something and just injures people and, and takes down their health. Uh, SVD and the MK17, especially MK17, especially I'm saying, is because this gun has a lot more range than the SVD. Uh, this gun is perfect for you. But obviously, like I said before, uh, it sounds and it looks like the SVD can shoot faster. I'm gonna have to say it does. I feel like it just is able to be shot in faster, even though uh, statistically it says it can't be. But like I said, the recoil pattern right here, you guys can see it's super, super easy to manage. Look at this, barely any recoil. It's super, super easy to control. Therefore, I think it's the better gun out of these two. Uh, I would probably pair this up with a dead eye, maybe. <clears throat> now, obviously, I would have liked to have this video with the Urban MDR and this SVD, but I don't have that weapon yet, so that's the reason why it's the MK17. Once I get the SVD, I'll make a, uh, a new video for this, and I'll put the SVD and the MDR, but that's basically it, guys. SVD over MK17, depending on what kind of player you guys are, slower or faster, it depends. Uh, but yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed. Make sure you drop a like, subscribe, all the good stuff. Thanks for watching. Peace out. Tell me pretty lies, look me in the face, tell me that you love me, even if it's